We are in a, a period um, where happiness is more important than ever in thinking about communities and organizations and it begs the question of why is it so important today? And I think there are a couple of broad answers and the first is um, we know from a lot of broad survey data um, that people feel overloaded, they feel overworked, people are working harder today than they did 30 years ago. Teens and families are more stressed out than they were 30 years ago, we know empirically and scientifically. Um, and so that, that leads people to really ask this question of how can I find happiness, how can I make my team more happy. Uh, happiness is more important than it has been in the past 50 years. And then the second reason that happiness is so important and why people are seeking it and trying to cultivate it and develop it is we now know from 250, 300 studies that happiness has a lot of benefits. So the first is happiness is good for your physical health and your life expectancy. So when you have strong social ties, when you feel grateful, when you laugh, um, it benefits your nervous system, it benefits your immune system, and it contributes six to 10 years to your life expectancy. So that really matters. The second thing in terms of benefits is happiness is great for creativity and innovation. And we know from a lot of studies of people at work and working on hard problems that when I feel joyful or awe or grateful or I'm empathetically connected to other people, not only does my uh, the rigor of my work improve and the quality of my innovations, but so too does the work of people around me. So happiness is really good for workplace functioning.